take a look at the hotel down in Edinburgh, just a, a little bit of a patriotic theme developing here. That's kind of cool. You can see the flags uh, on the front of the building there. Also love the uh, retro Pepsi thermometer up there. Perfect for weather as well as red, right, and blue there. So we've got a little temperature going on. Sam Catania painting cam with the red, white, and blue. Uh, thanks for that. So. Uh, Get a look at the Memorial Day outlook. Actually, it's, it's really good right now. Now, of course, you know, we're five to seven days away. Things can change. But the trend right here is a warming trend, which means it starts out a little cooler than normal, but then it gets to above normal. Clouds and sunshine, little to no precipitation expected. And as far as daylight, you're getting into maximum daylight, like sunrise at 10 to 6 in the morning, sunset at quarter to nine. So things are looking good for now. And we'll keep, of course, track of that uh, throughout the week and into the holiday weekend. Speaking of Edinburgh, lake temperature reported by Pat and Lore at 67 degrees for their triathlon. That's after Memorial Day on the first weekend of June. And as we take a look at the big lake, uh, water temperature slowly coming up on Waterworks Beach there, uh, 59. Mostly sunny tomorrow, waves 1 to 3, northwest winds 10 to 15 knots. So uh, temperatures uh, pretty much lower than normal now, getting back to normal, lowering a little bit. But again, what we're talking about happening here is a nice warming trend, and we'll show you that on the seven day in just a couple of minutes. So what's going on right now? Well, a high thin film of uh, cirrus clouds, which don't have any clout to produce any significant precipitation. You can see that here on storm tracker radar. So let's go south first, and that's where the heavier stuff is. And this is, of course, uh, Virginia, West Virginia, Tennessee, and North Carolina. But that is not moving in our direction. So we go west, and we see clusters of storms, Arkansas, Oklahoma, up into the Dakotas. But that is not moving significantly east. So we've got a break in the weather pattern. We're starting cool and then we're going to get milder. So 59 for our high today, obviously 12 below normal, and the low of 46 is 6 below normal. And if you take a look at the precip stats, we're way above normal for the month of May and about an inch and a half above normal for the year. So we're up to 14 hours, 50 minutes of daylight already. We've got good air quality today. We've got the slow warm-up and our next chance of significant precipitation, showers and storms on Thursday. Uh, 61, Doc Tom Miller, Niagara Pier, uh, 60, Josephine and Gerard, 58, Union City and Quarry, as well as Edinburgh. Down south, 59, Janet and Cambridge, uh, 61, Joyce in North Meadville, Rose in Espyville, and 62 from Karen in Titusville. Out to the east, pretty similar. Uh, 61, Warren Fire Department, as well as Kathy in Youngsville. So where do we go from here? Basically, We've got high pressure protecting us from the wet weather systems. And as we uh, go on into temperatures, it's cool on the east side of the high. It's warmer on the west. And you can also see the dew points and the relative humidities are low. So this is comfortable air. And as we spin the maps in motion, you can also see that we're dry not only for tomorrow, but as we go ahead into Wednesday, we are dry as well, perhaps a few more clouds. And it's not until Thursday when this front gets towards our area that we get some showers and storms. And once this thing gets through our area, and that will probably carry some showers on Friday, it sets us up nicely for the holiday. So for tonight along the lake shore, lows 45 to 49, just patchy clouds, a little on the cool side. Comfortably cool south of 90, Corey, Cambridge, Union City, your lows 44 to 48. And in the mountains to the east, Jamestown, Warren, Tyanesta, 41 to 45. Tomorrow, nice day, partly sunny, a little bit milder, upper 60s to low 70s. And on your seven day, Wednesday increasing clouds, warmer there. Showers, scattered storms on Thursday, some leftovers on Friday. Uh, looks like it'll clear out just in time for Saturday, Sunday, and Memorial Day. There's your warming trends, 72, 80, and 84, respectively. Check it all out on the weather page at yourerie.com. Sean and Jim.